through four days, how have you found your kind of first NHL development camp? Uh, I think, it, well, the first practice was uh, a little bit harder. Uh, it's been a while than uh, skating on the ice and getting all those uh, shots from guys like that played in the uh, AHL, like Colin White that played in the NHL, uh, also like guys like Drake Patterson. Um, yeah, it was pretty much like an icebreaker, but uh, did, after like a like, couple days, like it was uh, coming along and uh, now it was, uh, it was pretty good. So you're getting more comfortable with yeah. kind of the level of competition here? Yeah, for sure. Uh, it's for really fast, uh, quick shots, quick plays. Uh, so yeah. The goalie sessions you guys have been doing. How have you found kind of now being able, having the opportunity to work with Pierre Gru, kind of more one on one? Uh, well, for sure, that's uh, that's something big because uh, obviously uh, being able to to be with a goalie coach for Ottawa is uh, pretty pretty nice and. Uh, being able to do some one-on-one -on -one is, is huge, uh, but yeah, the experience uh, with Pierre is uh, pretty nice. Yeah. Is there anything specific he's he's got you kind of working on? Because uh, I know he's 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 one of, he's been a part of scouting you, and you talked with him, I think, at uh, the combine, and so you've kind of dealt with him. But this is your first opportunity to kind of where's he where's he starting? Is there anything he's working with you off the bat? Well, he just wants to break down my game, uh, see where I'm at. Uh, he really wants me to control my movements because uh, I had the tendency to do it really quick and be out of position. He wants me to take more time and uh, control my movements, so uh, maybe it takes a little bit more time, but I hit my spots. Uh, the goalies kind of have their own little thing going on. It's not unlike an actual team, right? The goalies kind of hang together and they yeah. do their own little things. Uh, are, you getting, are you getting to know kind of some of the other guys here? And um, what is it, how is it different for you being able to spend a little more time with some other goalies that you haven't met before? Oh uh, well, yeah, for sure. Uh, I kind of, kind of like knew like Drake before, so I kind of like met new people uh, with him. Um, but uh, knowing knowing uh, the the other goalies is pretty nice because they come from all over the world and uh, seeing guys like uh, Gussy that played uh, um, in the World Juniors uh, World Championship uh, that's pretty nice. Uh, having a guy like Hoggy that uh, played AHL and uh, it's he's uh, he's older and knowing like. Uh, having tips from him is pretty nice, and all of the played uh, CHL too is pretty nice to like have a guy uh, from the CHL and also a uh, Dax that played uh, Arizona State. It's pretty nice, yeah. Um, so, development camp's kind of like main event is tonight the uh, the red versus white scrimmage. Um, what are you expecting, kind of going into it, and and really being your first chance to play in front of uh, Sens fans? Oh, well, for me, I don't. Uh, have expectations. I just want to go there, uh, have fun. Uh, like I don't want to put too much press, uh, pressure on myself. That's why I don't really put some uh, expectations in my head. So uh, no, I want, just want to have fun and stop the fuck. It's been kind of a been a fun environment around here, right? You guys have done some axe throwing, and uh, but now it's like, is tonight going to be maybe a little bit more? Are we going to see a little bit more like com competition on the ice? Yeah, for sure. Because every uh, every guy wants to look good. Uh, obviously, it's going to be a lot a lot more competitive than uh, uh, the first couple of days uh, it's going to be more serious but uh, no like like I said everyone wants to leave a good impression so everyone's going to give their best